Hey collectors and builders, welcome back to another edition of the 124th News. We have a lot to cover for today. We're going to talk about Hexagear, we're going to talk about number 57, and we're going to talk about the new player in the game. I'm gonna be dropping some links in the description box and I'm gonna share a secret with you that your local store might not want you to find out. Click the subscribe button, sit back, relax, and let's get it started. First news of the day, let's talk about the new player in the game. If you're into Chinese mythology and classical novels like The Three Kingdoms, Water, Margin, Journey to the West, aka The Monkey King. And if you're into 124th skill, then you're gonna get hyped. There's a Chinese company by the name of Empire Sky. Well, that's what I'm calling it because Google Translate literally google translate they are launching the first wave of the 124th scale plastic model kits in january 2022 they are quite affordable kind of like the number 57 and we have a look at this chappy looking kit And we've got the Journey to the West. If you're not familiar with the Journey to the West story, basically it's about this Buddhist monk and the three disciples, including the Monkey King, which I'm sure everybody knows about the Monkey King, right? Anyways, they are searching for the Holy Scripture. So on the way, they encounter lots of weird creatures or monsters. I'm pretty excited about this because I actually grew up watching a TV show about this. And then they sci-fi and mech the heck out of these characters, which I thought it was pretty pretty cool. And guys, if I have more news about this line, you know where to find me. Speaking about Chinese companies, Creative Feel. Guys, they're doing amazing. They're on fire this year roll out kit after kit the ruin black and gold is out make sure you grab them right now and here's the big news people mr j mr j i have seen new pictures just released today so it's fresh guys what do we know so far they're giving you two core bodies not the grey color ones, but two brand new white color core bodies. You are getting three different heads, a bunch of accessories and weapons. But you know what I'm most excited about? Convertible, treasure, chest, and parrot. So basically you get the treasure chest and parrot. And you know how I was telling you about the secret earlier and this is where you're gonna screenshot the next 5 seconds of this video. Because I'm gonna share with you people the price list, the SRP in China. How much are they selling it in China? And of course for Mr. J, it's actually gonna be the most expensive kit from this series clocking in at 128 Chinese Yuan which is about 20 US dollars and check out this price list right here so the cheapest one would be the Dorman cabin coming in at 68 Chinese Yuan and of course all the armor puppets they cost the same even for the core body sets as well and we have the shadow wolf which is at 98 chinese yuan so screenshot right now and i'm telling you guys as a collector who's living outside of china i would like to know the real price you know because sometimes you found these things and they're selling for like what twice the price 
It's crazy, right? Hmm. And you know what, people? I'm gonna share with you a link right now on AliExpress. It is actually a very, very reliable store to get the armored puppets. I know sometimes when it comes to AliExpress, it can be a little bit sketchy or shady because you're buying from China, right? But here's the thing, always check the rating, the reviews, and I've actually known people who have bought from this store, which I'm gonna attach the link in the description. There's gonna be a bunch of links, so if they help you, subscribe to my channel. Fun fact, for those of you who are watching this for the first time, Exagear was actually the reason that I started this YouTube channel because I was looking for more videos about Hexagear but I couldn't really find it so I'm like what the heck I'm just gonna start a YouTube channel what's new this one right here Ta -da! this is the document of Hexagear is what I call the Bible of the Hexagear collectors this thing right here it is freaking heavy for a book it's about two and a half pounds or 1.2 kilogram of goodness over here very very well printed lots of cool pictures let me see if i can show you some i'm gonna be doing a review video on this one actually okay let's let's go to ah, let's go to this one oh, smells good so over here um i actually really really like the material is like you know how sometimes your hands are kind of oily and stuff but when you touch it there's no smudge it leaves no smudge okay so you have seen pictures of the crane and the block base i guess they're out if you're into those kind of things um you might want to check it out so basically it comes with the metal chain um crane and wire and whatnot so if you want to build yourself a hanger or like a warehouse for your Mac, go ahead. So you've got the block base 4 and 5. The 6 and the 7 which are the plates, fences and slat, slat, not slat. They are coming out later this week. So again, if you want to add more things to your collection, go ahead and do that. And of course, we have the Voltrax Wrath which is coming out in November. This is the better version of the previous Voltrax because as we all know, the legs, they don't work that well. It kind of sucks, just like Blazebore and Balkum. So for one, it's too short. For the other one, it's too weak. And hopefully, they have found a way to figure out the Voltrax Wrath. Maybe they should hire Captain Yoon for a quick consultation. Before I forget, you all remember the forklift? That was announced a couple of months ago right so yes we are getting a fort lift and the hexagear team actually asked for your help or asked for the fans opinion on which color do you think um is the best right because they haven't decided on it yet so you can go to their twitter which will be attached or included in the description box cast your vote last but not least people very excited to share with you that i am now part of the affiliate program with hobby link japan yay so yeah guys you can actually support my channel and my journey as a content creator on youtube covering hexagear armor puppets or 124th 
sometimes I do want a teen scale action figures too, like Joy Toy and Acid Rain. But my main focus is the 124th scale. These are so underrated, right? You can use this link shop.hlj.com slash mhobbytv to get your hexagear stuff. They have literally thousands of action figures and plastic model kits for collectors around the world like you and I. I think that's all for today. I hope you guys have gotten some pretty cool information and news. I will see you on November 24th for more news. See ya!